Hey guys, this is Chris Valani here. Today I'm going to make a video on how to control your computer with your Android device. Alright, first of all, what you're going to need is you're going to need to go to the Android market. Right here, sorry, Android market. And you're going to search. This, you can just search uh, VNC if you want. Wait till the search comes up, and it should be the top one right there. It says Android VNC Viewer. All right, so just click on that, download that. Okay, just wait till that installs. Got a new case for my uh, phone today. Today, it's pretty nice. Successfully installed. Got it. And you will have all this stuff here. Alright. Now I'll be right back when my computer turns on. Alright guys, now when you have the, the app installed, what you're gonna do now is you're gonna go to this website right here, tightvnc.com. You can download Tight VNC or Ultra VNC, whatever you want, they're both the same. I prefer Tight VNC, it's easier to use. Alright, so just go here, download that, and then when it's done downloading, I already have it downloaded, so we'll just go to it. Mine's right, it should be right there. Alright, so when you're here, you're gonna pin in a password. Alright, you apply it and everything should be good okay so you can close that now I'm gonna go back to that app you just made you just downloaded type the NC viewer and so let's just put something in let's pick Chris alright now password this is where you have to put what you put in the type VNC. This is where you put it in. Alright, so I'm just gonna put the camera away so you don't see my password. Alright, so I put in your password. Now your address would be your IP address for your computer. To find what it out what it is, you just go here. You go to your computer, go to start, go to run, and search CMD. Search that, and it'll get this uh, command prompt. And type in IP config. Alright, just type that in. So, one second. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. And port, just leave it how it is. And then. You just click connect. Alright? And it should start connecting. It'll go a little fuzzy for a bit on the computer. And there we go, guys. See that? It's pretty cool. You have your desktop on your computer, on your Android device. See, I can, I can move. It looks kind of small, but what you can do is you can just press menu and you do scaling much better like that. And you do one to one. It looks be much better like that, and you just move around like that. Okay? Now you can do all sorts of stuff. You can go on the internet, you can control iTunes with this. You can go on your start. Alright, you can go on. Internet. What a lot of people do are they go on this and they they go on like RuneScape and stuff like that. 
it works. All right. Just let me see. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty slow. It's not very good, but you know, just add as anyone that wants.